So after watching the DLC for Apocalypse trailer a couple of hundred times, um, I've compiled a really short video to express what we're going to be seeing inside Origins, and why I'm going to do that is ask Jason the question. So Jason, how big is this zombie map going to be? We have a larger scale than we've ever done before. Oh, really? Oh, okay. Uh, well, I guess that could be a good thing because we've been deprived of these characters for so long that we we might want a big map to explore more with them. Yeah, that, that, that's got to be it. I mean, transit wasn't horrible at all. We've introduced the zombie tank. Oh, the, the zombie tank. T tell me more. This is a defendable platform that'll move around the map, which you can use to fighting off the zombie hordes. Oh, so like the bus from transit. Well, not at all like the bus from transit. I mean, this map has nothing to do with transit. This, this isn't like transit at all. Uh, so let's let's think what's going to be on this tank if it's going to be better than the bus we're going to get a better weapon than the b 23 art maybe a bit more steadier maybe we're going to um fire some grenades or some big torpedoes instead of just driving around with ted i mean they could easily break into the bus so this tank's going to be unstoppable what else dynamic weather oh god from rain oh dear snow falling oh i didn't like the snow and call the dead fog rolling in fog are you serious fog i no one liked transit, Jason. No one. And you know why? The map was too big. They had to cover it up with fog so you could render the damn thing. Why include more fog? We don't want denizens in 1917, even though it was hinted in Dare East. He's actually on a cork board. I might include a picture. I might not. But Jason, are you serious? We don't like big maps that we have to catch a stupid transport system on to go around all the time. And if we miss it, we've got to trek 100 miles. That's not what we want. We want small, compact. Pack maps, Dare East, Shino Numa, Vurok. These were the best maps you have ever, ever made. So why include these huge maps that no one wants? We don't care how big these robots are. We just want a really small map that we don't have to catch a tank on to ride to the next destination. Fix it, please. 